our physical appearance is in a way completely irrelevant when it comes to what, what rights or not rights to apply to us. Uh, I mean, we can imagine that some entities come down from Mars who look entirely different from us. How would we decide that they are either like us uh, or that they are wild beasts or autom automatons? And the answer is, we would have to try out if, if they can engage in some sort of argumentation or not. Um, they might look entirely different from us. They might be ten times as large as we are or ten times as small as we are or have uh, different hairdo or who knows what. The decisive is, in fact, can they argue or can they not argue? Uh, can they rely on the, f on the force of words, so to speak, in order to induce people to do certain actions and abstain from, uh, from other actions? So, can we conclude, for example, that uh, uh, there, is a, uh, there is a moral right of the parents before the private property of uh, uh, his sons over their, uh, his own body. There is a, so uh, the moral right pre-exists of the uh, private right? Yes, I, I, agree. <coughs> I agree, but in the sense that you say the libertarian ethics is only concerned to speak with punishable offenses and non-punishable offenses. Uh, uh, moral things go beyond that and are punished in a different way. They are punished by ostracism, um, by not having anything to do with people who do such and such, um, by cutting them off from, from other ties, by boycotting them, uh, by telling other people, this is a swine, how can you possibly deal with this person, or this is a really decent and good man, we should just help him out. Um, so what the, what the libertarian ethic does is, is so speak, does not answer all questions that arise in life. It only helps us to make sense. Should this be punished? Uh, or should this not be punished with physical threats? Um, but coming back to what Christian said before, Yes, you can also be a libertarian not breaking any property raw, laws and still you can be the most unpleasant person that you can possibly imagine with whom you never would want to have anything to do and there exist quite a few of those. 